And welcome back, this is Bella Scuba with another StarCraft II commentary. I am the Red Terran in the North, wishing good luck and have fun to Mr. Hands. Um, not, oh, there we go. He says, thank you. Um, that's kind of weird. He is the Blue Terran in the West. Um, he is Mr. Hands, not Mr. Hat. I'm determined to make fun of everybody's name, apparently. Uh... He goes for, uh, one of his initial pro, uh, SCVs goes for his scout. I'm um, not sure how important that is um, to get scouting done that early, but he does, looks like he just went for that one down there, so he's just trying to prevent a banshee. Make sure that, you know, if he needs to go for banshees, I'm actually going to do the same. I want to make sure that this one right here is open, because that does change the strategy quite a bit for this map, knowing the the uh, starting location of your opponent. Uh, this The map, I don't think I mentioned it, it's Metalopolis. Metalopolis. Uh, so there the SV goes for another one. No, so I do know where he is, but now I do want to see what he's doing because uh, this would give me a good insight as to how I should react. Uh, of course, he's not doing anything out of the ordinary here. He does have his block off up and oh I just get in right past the marine there uh, he actually still doesn't know where I am so he's going to check out the Zelnaga tower always a good idea uh, the Zelnaga towers of course you can see the other Zelnaga tower with it and both expansions and he'll be able to see if well he won't be able to see because the armies will be moving here, so he won't be able to see them, but if I did spawn here, or here, here, he would be able to see those with the Zelnaga Towers. Unfortunately, I picked the, he had picked the wrong uh, time to pick that strategy, because I am in the wrong starting position. Tech Lab going down on my second barracks. We should see a Tech Lab going down on that third one as well. Factory coming up. Uh, looks like he's actually going for pretty much the same build. He did go for the tech labs first, so he can get out some early marauders, it looks like. And he's going to be going for a fast expansion. Six minutes into the game, he's going for an expansion. I'm not even thinking about it. I don't even have enough. I don't. I have just about half what I would need for an expansion. He's got about the same as I do, even though I have a huge lead in harvesters, which means I have a bigger army. Look at the size of that. 7-1 uh, as opposed to 2-4. So what I really should be doing is attacking. But I'm scared it did. And I always turtle up for the early game because I'm scared of an early rush. And look at that. Nothing coming out of the factory. And he's instantly going into a starport. Um, so we should be seeing probably Banshees. That'd be my guess. But he doesn't. he would need that second guys are for banshees and he's back in the game pretty much four six nine three that's pretty even feel free to correct me if I'm wrong I'm not that great at the math yet yeah I'm gonna assume that he's even six eight eleven five that's pretty close there and uh, oh looks like I am getting missile turrets up early because I am expecting Banshees. Is he getting Banshees? Who, and he's not getting much of anything right now. Um, he is getting Marines, Marauders, Orbital Command, and the Vespian Geyser. Yeah. That just went up. Um, there we go. Seeing a Medivac out. So that Medivac is really going to skew things in his direction. I am getting Siege Tech. I do not have, see a Siege tank coming out, but Starport is going up. And he scans. And he sees both my Starports. Oh, that was a great scan by him. I don't really blame him for it. And Reactor and Attack Lab going down. No Siege Tanks coming out yet. Oh, one is out. And look at the size of the army. Oh, that's where it went. Look at this. Oh, I am screwed. Even though they have the one attack upgrade, he just had too many. If I had sent that siege tank along, it really would have helped. Uh, but I didn't. And here he goes for the counterattack. And no, I'm going to...
to say that I still have the lead here. Um, it depends on the positioning of that medevac. Yes, I do get a pot shot off. <laughs> but, but now he knows that there's a siege tank. Oh, now I have a second one up. Just one medevac. Um, actually, he, he might. This is quite a bad position for me, allowing the concave. Oh, and I'm able to get quite a few pot shots off there. And so now he, of course, is moving up to siege tanks. Where is it? There it is. And here he goes for the medevac drop. But I do have the missile turrets up, and he's able to save that with just 40. Oh, one more shot, and that would have been it. So I do move out. Oh, that's not a good idea. Don't move out. But I feel like I need the expansion now. I mean, look at that. I'm low in minerals, so I do attack. And it's going to be close. No, it looks like he's going to be taking the victory here. Just too many marauders for me. But these siege tanks, oh, oh, I got one shot off. Vikings out now. Going to be able to take out those medevacs when they start coming again. Uh, but, yes, there is one coming out. He is getting stim pack and armor up one. I do have stim pack as well. Do I have, I don't have combat shields though. Does he have combat shields? No, he does not. Uh, so I was about to say he did have a slight advantage there, but he didn't get it either. And here I go for another push because I want to expand. And I'm not going to be able to win this here. The two tanks need to be sieged up, and of course they had bad timing there. Vikings going down, and it's going to be close. One on one. Uh, uh, oh, look at that. He's the better drive-by shooter. But I send in reinforcements and they take out the job. So I am slightly ahead. What does he have left? He's got nothing. Oh my gosh. Look at that. If I had pushed for a counterattack, that would have been pretty much the game. Look at that. 2-2. Two, two. Oh, look. Go, 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 go. No, I'm going to stay there. Because I, oh, it's, he's got quite a bit of an army now, but he didn't for a time. I did not go for the counterattack. I went for, I just wanted to secure the expansion, but of course he's had one up for quite a while, only getting uh, minerals from it. So he only has the lead in the minerals here. And oh my gosh, look how oversaturated I am. So that's probably why I didn't go for the counterattack because I did need